Everyone is counting on me. While Shard and his small band were returning from their travels, it was then that Alomir returned to the tree. It appeared his mission had been a success, although it was more dire than even I had expected. Within his talons, he carried a moon-blinked owlet, a title, young Soren's sister Eglantine. Alomir told a tale of pure one treachery. His wingmen had not survived the attack, but Alomir had escaped and had been able to wrestle this young owlet from the pure ones before he did. Suddenly, with the treachery of the pure ones confirmed, the parliament before unconvinced of Soren's story called all the guardians to battle. I feared we did not know enough of the pure ones plot. But my duty called me to stand beside my fellow Guardians, and right yet another wrong. When Shard returned, he discovered that all the Guardians had taken up arms. And there, within my hollow, a note from me left him with a fateful choice. Dear Shard, it has come to this. War. The other Guardians and I have rushed into the heart of the darkness to make our stand against this pure one threat. My gizzard stirs. I do not know what we will find there, and I fear for the worst. There is no doubt that we will need you and the knowledge you have gained from your journeys. Join us when you are ready, for we'll need every battle claw we can muster. Shard felt frustrated at being left behind. And he became doubly so when he saw Sauron and his comrades flying off to find the Guardians. Following them seemed the only option. And so it was they found themselves headed towards that baleful land of rocky spires known as the Beaks. As we've journeyed through the kingdoms, you have continued to prove your mettle as a guardian again and again. The battle in the beaks will truly test us, Shard. I will proudly fight by your side, my friend. that up ahead I don't know could be a fortress let's fly closer to get a better look Sean beds they're everywhere I'm starting to feel strange the bats have created a flex barrier around me Keep attacking the bats, Shard. I feel the effects of the flex starting to lift. I'm free from the bats' flex barrier, Shard. I'm... Now, the tables have turned. Let's show them what we're made of. They won't even see what hit them. Don't stand a chance. 
I'm sorry, Parzival. I ran you headlong into that trap. Guess I was fooling myself. I'm not much of a leader. Nonsense. You made sure I got out of it alive. That's what a leader does. Come on, let's find the Guardians. <laughs> 